Part three. So we must not only restore our waterways, but we must uh, halt the deforestation caused by that uh, the strangulation of the water um, and the deforestation from the timber industry and uh, from groups like Green Diamond locally threatening our forests here, which is uh, headed by, I believe, a secretary general of the Bilderberg Group, the uh, international cabal that's been running world affairs founded by uh, Nazi Prince Bernhard. Uh, look that stuff up yourself. You can watch the film Endgame, uh, also free online if you want to learn more about that. But we must stop and prevent these wars on all fronts of all forms, whether they're against our environment or against our freedoms or against foreign people uh, to be exploited for our own benefit, um, whether we directly get it or not, uh, to unite with other groups and see that we shouldn't divide ourselves for fear of being too radical. Radical means root, as opposed to the symptomatic treatment of problems that we generally see today in society. So we must be proud to see the interwoven fabric of oppression that exists and enlist support of everyone in unraveling it. This is our duty, and we can provide our own power politically, agriculturally, electrically, monetarily, and uh, awareness-wise in our own communities, bioregionalism. So that means uh, that our, our names and money won't be uh, going towards spilling blood and promoting misery around the globe and here at our own homes. Uh, learn that we may be capable of waging an effective campaign against tyranny, because you have to understand your enemy in the battlefield and your allies and resources if we are to triumph over, our, over evil. Otherwise, we will uh, fall victim to the elite secret societies like the Illuminati and Skull and Bones, Bush and Kerry were both part of Skull and Bones in 2004. Uh, Roundtable groups such as the Royal Institute of International Affairs in the UK, controlling media, education, history, and policies with the intent to merge us into a commonwealth of nations, a one world government, a new world order, as revealed by Carol Quigley in his book, Tragedy and Hope, um, Bill Clinton's mentor, actually. And uh, Quigley was part of these groups, established the CFR here in our country, Council on Foreign Relations, doing the same objective, also in other countries like Canada and New Zealand. We must learn and we will understand why things are the way they are today, why banks have us at their uh, uh, mercy of a slave cu currency that oils both sides of conflicts. And uh, we pay the Taliban for safe passage, for example, f uh, with our money, the money they use to fight us. Uh, we must not let the elite promote further power as a solution to their generated problems, like a new Pearl Harbor that they said, uh, as, a, as a basis for endless war. I hope that we can thwart these plots and take back some ground, and I'm honored to uh, give my life for these ideals, and I hope that you are as well. Let's get this revolution started today. Every minute, every waking moment, uh, promote it with our uh, every ounce of strength that we've got and keep it present in our thoughts and join other groups in the community. Start to work together, arm yourself with knowledge. Knowledge is power. And what's that website and the name of your show? Uh, the website of our TV show is unstackingthedeck.nimg.com. That's the name, Unstacking the Deck. And it's aired here locally in Humboldt County. Once again, we're here today at the Eureka Courthouse for the Iraq War anniversary. Uh, check out my show, watch Access Humboldt.